I've been meal prepping for five years. I needed a break. So we decided to give Muscle Maker Grills meal plan services a try. The process is pretty simple. You basically order on the website, they prepare the food, and you go pick it up, or they can deliver it to you. As you saw in the screenshot, we ordered our first meal in May, and I'm just getting around to doing the review, but that actually worked out well. Here is a shot of the old menu, hint, hint, and the old pricing. They have salads, they have pasta, they have wraps, they have bowls. Just a quick note about how excited I was about finding this. When I placed my first order, I did not have a menu, so I didn't know any of the macros. So I just ordered stuff blindly for my first set of meals. So please take note of that while I'm going through the first set of meals in my first order. So here's the full view of the old menu. And ta-da! New menu. <laughs> the new setup debuted around mid-August, probably beginning of August. Just to quickly cover the changes between the two menus. One, the price has gone up slightly. Two, they did a little marketing and renamed a lot of the meals. And three, they changed the timing because before you had to give them um, like two to three days notice in order to get an order process. And now all they need is four hours. So that is a one really major change that I really enjoy. A meal prep pickup for Steve. For Steve. A Steve. Right so, this is what it looks like when I picked it up. All right, so I literally came in from picking up my first three meals from Muscle Maker. And this is how it came. Basically, I have the first three meals for both of us. One meal for six days for two people. Plus, and I'll show you those real quick. All right, so my first reaction is um, like the chicken and broccoli. See, yeah, I thought there would be a little bit more chicken. Um, it looks like four ounces, but I'm not sure I'm gonna have to weigh it. So we'll see. You pick up on Mondays and you pick up on Thursdays. Um, and I didn't coordinate the meals to go with that kind of system because my repeat days are Mondays and Fridays. So if I pick up Monday night, I'm already having my Monday refeed for lunch. The reason why they do it that way is so that the food doesn't go bad in your refrigerator. So it makes sense, but I would have to reconfigure the way I do things. I'm gonna have to figure it out. Um, but with the meals I do have, I can always adjust my macros accordingly. Um, so yeah, we shall see. Oh, the Godfather Bowl. If you're just looking for something super simple and super tasty with a lot of flavor, boom.
<laughs> one thing you do have to know about my soulmate is that he is not easily impressed. So please take his reviews with a grain of salt. I had finally ordered this meal for myself weeks later and it was freaking delicious. <laughs> He's crazy. Oh my god, it smells so good. I definitely like the Santa Fe wrap. Again, I asked my soulmate. He said it was fine. That means it was delicious. He's crazy again. <laughs> so if you're looking for super clean, super basic, you can have the chicken and broccoli. I added some rice and uh, sweet potato to it for my macros. Um, and again, it was only four ounces of chicken, so there you are. Thank goodness I did this review because I completely forgot all about this taco salad. It's really good. I really liked it. I keep forgetting to order it. <laughs> and as explained on the menu, certain meals get certain sauces. They come in the cute little containers and there you are. So as I said before, I completely blindly ordered my first week. So when I went to go pick up my food, I saw there was an actual menu with all the macros on it. It wasn't on the website at the time. So I sat, I made a copy of the menu, uh, one for my soulmate, one for me, of the meals we both would like separately. I made notes on the menus. I saw which ones needed more protein, stuff like that. I get really organized and I was ready <laughs> for my second week. I am also way too nosy for my own good. I went looking around the internet and also on the order website at other locations and I saw New York had like real labels, like cool labels. My location seems to not have that. So on my order for the second week, I asked them if they could mark it, and they did. It was really cute. They really did try. So I really did appreciate that. As a newbie, it's hard to know which meal is which, so it helped with my confusion. <laughs> The barbecue chicken wrap is hands down my favorite. It has perfect macros for my swole mate. No doctoring needed. In my snooping on the internet, I did find this cool meal plan uh, based off of goals that I thought was very interesting. It might help out a beginner figure out what meals they would like to order or give a shot. Um, and yeah, I thought it was really cool. And here's another marketing splash sheet that I found that talks about um, what products they use, what they don't use. And yeah, there is an option to get low carb wraps, so be sure to put those in your notes if you want low carb instead of regular wraps. Um, I tried the low carb, they're cool, but I'd rather just put my macros around the real wraps. <laughs> those are delicious. <laughs> 
All right, so I'll just quickly take you through the website. It's a super simple website. You go to ordermmg.com, and um, again, when they made the changes to the menu, they also made lots of changes to the website. So I wish I took screenshots before um, they made the changes, but that's all right. So basically, you go to the website, you find your location that's nearest to you. Um, you can create a account. They ask for the normal information, and then you log into your account. It'll show you your account information. It'll also give you your order history, which I really liked. With the order history, there was an option to reorder. As you see, my very, very first order is listed there. That's because it was takeout. But with the new website, my meal plan orders aren't allowed to be reordered. So hopefully they fix that glitch because it was an awesome feature just to go back and reorder from a previous week. The very first step to ordering is selecting on your left order meal plans and then you select on the right how many meals you want to order. Of course, I do the 10 meal option. Now all you got to do is select your 10 meals. And on the old website, it was a daunting task because you could tell from some of my screenshots, you had to select two meals for Monday, two meals for Tuesday, two meals for Wednesday, but I didn't pick up till Monday night. So Mondays was technically Tuesday. For It got a little confusing. So this was a welcome change. You just select your 10 meals and there you go. If there's something you particularly don't care for or if you're dairy free or something like that, you can choose exceptions to remove from your meals at the bottom. If you really are busy and you wanna add beverages, you can add that. If you wanna add some um, additional items, you can add that. I have to say some of their sauces are so good, so I wouldn't mind having more of those. <laughs> This screen also reminds me of the old website. One thing that I absolutely loved about the old website is because as I've said previously, sometimes the protein um, isn't enough for our macros. So they had a really cool option at the bottom of every meal you selected, you could add extra animal protein to each meal and it seamlessly was just put in with your meal so you know it's not so hard with salads or bowls you know I can order some extra side chicken now on the new website and cut it up and put it on top of the other thing you know those open items but for the wraps it's really hard because some of the protein is a little bit lower than what I would like my swole mate to get for a lunch so I was able to add more chicken, I was able to add steak, I was able to add shrimp uh, to each wrap and they will cook it inside of the wrap. It was awesome. Unfortunately, that option is gone also now. Um, I did voice my opinion. <laughs> the top message is what I sent to my local muscle maker. I know it's not their fault because I went to every other location's website and I saw it was a full change, a nationwide change. Um, so I wrote a message to them and then the message below is what I wrote to the corporate website. Um, just voicing my opinion that you know I appreciated the new website because yeah the old one definitely needed a huge overhaul but they took away one of my favorite <laughs> options so I had to voice my opinion <laughs> with that said I was promptly contacted by the owner of my local muscle maker grill apologizing he cc'd all the tech people and every other would handle fixing the issue with the website and he asked for me to call him and i will put my order in directly with him so that was so super awesome way above what he had to do and i truly appreciated it because i really wasn't bluffing like i literally went to the market and bought meat to make our own lunches so i called him and i placed the order for the next week because i really wasn't bluffing i, I was just gonna go back to making my own meal sadly while i cried <laughs> back to the website you can also order dessert that sugar-free cheesecake is to die for you must try it it is amazing
And as I mentioned before, they do deliver based on mileage. So definitely check out to see if your muscle maker delivers to you. So I literally just got back from Muscle Maker Grill. I placed my order at noon. It was ready by four o'clock. So that is an awesome new thing with the new website. Uh, I was standing there and the guy gave me some free shrimp, so yay. <laughs> um, so I got my order without Sean's help this week. So I have my five meals, I have Mike's five wraps, and then uh, I went ahead and to make up for the missing protein, I just ordered three sides of chicken. So that $4 chicken, I just ordered three sides of it. Um, and basically I'm just going to eat half of it with my each of my meals. Because the side of chicken is basically how I was figuring out my macros on my fitness pile anyway, so I can just cut that up and put that on top of my meals. Uh, the only thing for my soulmate is uh, for his wraps, I just tried to order the ones with the most protein so that, because it wouldn't be easy for him to add additional meat to his wraps. Mm, yes, I decided to treat myself to some cheesecake and it's so awesomely good. You have to try it. Oh my God, it's so good. And of course, I got the dressings for my meals. And also a random salad, so there's that. <laughs> and then I got some free shrimp because I was standing there at the time and the guy cooked too much, so he gave me six or seven or eight shrimp. <laughs> and with this order, I can officially say the reorder button is back. I'm so excited. I'm so happy they fixed that issue. As you can see, all the orders below don't have the reorder button, but the one from today does. Yay! So I say all that to say my personal pros for pre-ordering meal prep. <laughs> Number one, the ordering process is pretty simple. Number two, location. I have a Muscle Maker Grill near my house. I have a Muscle Maker Grill near my job. I could get it delivered if I want to. I choose to pick it up. Number three, Muscle Maker Grill is known in the bodybuilding community. Uh, since if you already visit the restaurant, you know how they cook, what they cook, and you basically have access to their current menu for your meal prep. So you know what you're getting. Four is reasonably priced. There are lots of meal prep competitors out there uh, with a ever rotating menu, but their prices are a lot higher. Um, Muscle Maker Grill is a lot simpler. Um, with a simpler price point even though the price has gone up since when I began in May um, it's still not a crazy amount of money number five shorter grocery trips in and out of the grocery store I'm basically only cooking for our dinners and picking up snacks so it definitely makes going to the grocery store a lot more bearable <laughs> number six fresh and clean so let's talk about the cons number one for my cons is the protein so the macros on the meals I have to still do a little customizing to make it match what I'm looking for um, on the old website again it was easier for me to add additional protein to each of the meals now it's a little bit harder um, so I kind of missed that option it it made it a little bit more bearable for our, ma our macros um, so I kind of wish I took screenshots of the ordering website before so you can see what I'm talking about but it was super easy but um, yeah so that's my number one con is the macros I have to do a little customizing to make it work for us and that would basically be true with any meal prep company we went we would go with you know the muscle maker actually has a good set of macros compared to a lot of other places speaking of macros number two is the fat some of the meals have a lot of fat in them so that's why I printed out both of the menus um, and just made marks because you know if I'm having like a high carb day I'll go with a higher fat meal um, because I'll just 
interchange the fats for the carbs blah 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 but yeah some of the meals do have a lot of fat in them and my friend who recommended muscle maker to me that was her deciding factor as to why she couldn't go with muscle maker is the fat content it was just a little bit too hot for her for some of the meals number three was the website it is a lot better now so i kind of wish i had taken my screenshots like three weeks ago so you guys can compare how different the website looks but um they you know they still have some tweaking to go i kind of wish like i said i could customize my macros a little bit more um but yeah they definitely did a lot better with this new website number four labeling i think this is just a local issue um i saw that some other places like in new york or so they have customized labels um and i wish my location would use those because especially that first week when i ordered i had no idea what i was doing i just did it blindly and having those labels would have definitely helped me figure out what was what. Like I had to look at the menu, see which one had rice, which one had cheese. Oh, this one doesn't have onions though, so this can't be this one. It, it was really confusing. As I showed you, I asked them to put labels on it. They remembered when I picked up on Monday, they forgot when I picked up on Thursday. That wouldn't be a problem anymore since it's one day pickup. But um, yeah, if we just had the labels, that would be awesome. And my last kind, number five, the menu. So because it's through a restaurant, they use their restaurant menu to do the meal plan, meal prep. I, I personally do not mind eating the same thing on over, over, over and over again, but some people may. You know, th there is a lot to choose from based on your macros, but it could get a bit repetitive. Even we take weeks off, like some breaks in between, um, not because we're sick of the food or anything, but you know, to save a little money here and there. We have taken a week off here because we were going on vacation, so we didn't need it. Or, you know, there was a holiday coming up, so I was going to be home, so I might as well cook anyway. Stuff like that. So, um, yeah, the menu can get a bit repetitive, uh, and so that's when some people may look to competitors who cycle through a new menu every single week. So I hope this video helped you maybe decide to try prepaid, pre-ordered meal prep out. Uh, if Muscle Maker is one of the places, definitely give them a try even if it is just for a week. If you want to try some other companies, definitely give them a try and just do your research before you sign up for anything. The most important thing is to make sure to find something that works for you. In other news, while I was creating this video, I realized I hit a thousand subscribers on YouTube. Thank you guys so much for your support. I appreciate it so much and thanks for hanging in there with me. <laughs>